What's going on everybody? It's your boy, Sant Roos. We're going to be testing out a Winter Survival Simulator demo. It's on Steam. It's free right now. Welcome to the Winter Survival Simulator demo. This is the first look at Winter Survival Simulator, the survival simulator experience. You'll find yourself in a cold, harsh environment after a close and bloody encounter with a bear. With one single goal in mind, to survive. Nobody but yourself to count on. You have to fight your own sanity to get through it. Join us on a journey of discovery and learning how to handle various situations, and we hope you will like it. He's what hurt. the hell just happened? He's hurting. Shit. It's so cold. I can't feel my fingers. Body heat. After spending the night outside, your body temperature has dropped drastically. Your hands are frozen, which means you are unable to interact with anything. Stand next to any heat source to get warm and regain full control over your body. Tip, your body temperature can be tracked in the top right corner of the screen. Press H to close. Quest started the long night. Alright, so right now my cold level is at frostbite. Oh, okay. So it kind of gives us a little tracker over there. What's this? Ah, uh, can't interact. Hopeless. Can't interact with anything. My fingers are frozen stiff. We'll just follow this for now. I've got to figure something out. Danger with the wolf. Uh oh. Alright. We might be walking into a, a wolf's den here. Holy cow. God, I have to be careful. Sanity. Your sanity is lowered by your poor condition and fear of dangers lurking in the forest. The lower your sanity, the closer you are to madness and further away from survival. Hallucinations are one of the first symptoms of losing sanity. Harmless at first, dangerous later. Tip, be careful when exploring. For example, wolves will intimidate you and lower your sanity. Wild animals may injure, may injure or kill you if you approach them too closely. I have a flashlight on my head, on my head or something. There's a wolf right there. Oh my gosh, this is so scary. I literally thought that wolf was about to jump on me.
Ooh, okay, here we go. Heat source. Ambient temperature. Body temperature, upper right corner of the screen, changes according to the ambient temperature. Ambient temperature, upper left corner. Depending on the weather and your equipment, the ambient temperature will feel different. Natural heat sources like this geyser can warm you and save your life. Tip, find and remember the locations of natural heat sources in case of emergencies. Too easy. So the top right quarter of my screen right now went from frostbite up to neutral. Oh. Oh. That feels much better. Oh, no. oh great. No, no, no. Run! Oh, great. Here we go. Oh, I can run now. All right. I can't really run before. I want to guess they're right behind me. I don't really want to turn around to look. Ah! Oh, not this again. Uh -oh. Health bar represents your physical condition. Avoid dangers such as wildlife heights and take care of your other basic needs to do needs so that your health doesn't drop to zero. You can find the health bar in the lower left corner of your screen. My leg. I need to take care of this. It's not letting me move right now. Buffs and debuffs. Some activities leave negative effects called debuffs. Debuffs make your survival harder, such as frozen hands or, in this case, a sprained ankle. Over time, you'll learn about other debuffs, what effect they have, and most importantly, how to get rid of them. A sprained ankle limits your movement. One way to remove a debuff like this is to find a med kit. A cabin here. I should check inside. So the wolves are up there. I guess I go... Maybe this way? It won't let me run or anything. Also, task. On the left side of my screen it says investigate the hut. Zero out of one. So, we're going to go over here. Hey, there we go. There's a little hut. What the heck? You guys see? Whoa! All right, I'm getting inside. What is wrong with me? I'm getting inside. I have to pull myself together. If I can find the door here. So there's a wolf right there. Oh, that's kind of cool. Side. Okay. There's a med kit. Hey, everything you pick up goes straight into your inventory. The size of your inventory depends on your equipment. You can drag and drop items into quick slots for faster access. To open inventory, press I. Much better. Still, this cold is killing me. I need to do something about it. Starting a fire. Fireplaces and shelters are ready to use. You only need to add fuel to light them. To do this, open the fireplace UI and click on any fuel item in your inventory, for example, wood chunks. Once you're happy with the amount of fuel, light the campfire by pressing light up.
There you go. Is this thing still on? I should save the battery for later. All right, well. Okay. That's enough. Press F to toggle flashlight. Oh, okay. All right. So I got the fire on. Get my dude all nice and toasty here inside the cabin. I guess I'm good to. I think it doesn't matter how close or far I am from this thing. It's just going to warm me up regardless. Uh, so go to sleep. We'll go to bed here. Fucking trip. I hope the others are doing fine. So he said he hopes the others are doing fine. Alright, so the sleep length is preset during the tutorial. After you'll be able to freely choose the length of sleep. Alright. Oh, terrible night. Right. I have to go back there and get my stuff. Oh, great. Lost and found. Retrieve your gear. So I'm warm right now. And... My body temperature is nice and warm. So I am a little thirsty. But it looks like there was a canteen back there. I just couldn't pick it up due to me... ...being a little frostbit. Uh, alright, we got some ice here. You just slide. Yeah, I'm sliding right now. I'm not even walking forward. Let's just run, and crouch. Whee! That was not as cool as I thought it was going to be. But you can slip around on ice a little bit. Oh, <coughs> goodness. Alright. There's that canteen. Thirst, the quickest way to quench your thirst is eating snow. Take note that it replenishes your fluid slightly and lowers your body temperature. You can find natural sources of water as well. Be careful with hot springs as their waters are harmful to drink. Shit, it's empty. Although, there is plenty of snow around here. I guess we'll just get his thirst up here. Right, he's nice and hydrated. Find a way back to your find a way to your backpack. Where's my backpack? Alright, this way. I wonder if running warms you up. Back on the log again. Guess I can just jump. Bear tracks. And footprints next to it. It doesn't look good. I have to check it out. Instinct mode. Your instinct will show you all the additional information about your condition. Points of interest and even your surroundings. To toggle instinct mode, press Q. Bagoosh. Wolves are extremely dangerous and will kill you with ease. Avoid them at all costs. Plus three sanity lost is icy. So once you turn it on, it stays on. Then you have to repress it to turn it off. Raw potato. Carrot. I'm really cold right now. Hopefully, my backpack here. There are some goodies. Better be careful. I just kind of sent it. Got it. Let's see if there's anything in here I can put on. Nothing.
I literally have brought a backpack with nothing in it. Sweet. Dude's run so fast. So it's saying follow the bear tracks. Oh, that's cool. I don't know what the green means though. I don't know if it's just like an indicator or if that means it's it was just, like it's getting worse. there's blood. Yeah. I hope they're okay. So we're down here. Right now we're at Frostbite, so. So this is not the same one we came to earlier. Because you remember there's like that little walkway in the middle, you know? There's a little path in the middle. This one don't have it. So this is a new hot spring. Now the guys are there. close I can get to this thing without getting in. I want to get nice and toasty. So I was at Frostbite, now, now I'm at Icy. That's kind of cool. So I'm going to get warmed up here and we will continue on mission. I do gotta say, I do like the graphics. The graphics are nice. Not too bad. Pretty good. I'm at neutral. Let me get a few extra seconds until I'm nice and warm. Alright, I think this is as. I think I hear a bear, and I think this is as warm as I can get. Alright, so here's the bear tracks. I don't know why I would want to follow these things. Go the right way. I just ran towards the indicator. All right, so. Coming up on a bridge here. The trail ends here. They probably reached the other side, but no. The bridge doesn't look very stable. We'll find a way. I'm just not ready yet. I think I saw their camp on the way. Maybe I can help myself to what's left. Investigate the camp. There's like things laying around the woods. I can. Whoa, this is icy. I was like, wait, I'm sliding here. Nice. Food ration. You can find different types of food will, which will affect your hunger differently. Cooking food is the best form of processing a meal. But for that, you need a fire camp. Cold food will not fill your stomach much, and sometimes you cannot eat it at all. It's about time to head back. You really need to eat something. So I have, an, I have a new indicator on the top right. Peckish. And I am warm, so we will move out.
trying to see if I can slide. But I can't. Alright, so we'll get back inside here. That's a well. Of course. I'm out of wood. I have to cut a tree. Find a tool to cut a tree. So your instinct mode looks like it can travel what do we through, have here? through walls. Open, open inventory and assign an axe to the quick slot. Pressing the number assigned to the quick slot will equip the axe. The larger the tree, the larger it takes to cut it down. Alright, so let's go get a tree here. This one looks... Like it's already kind of leaning a little bit. Oh no! That's kind of neat how it didn't just like fall through the tree, you know, it actually kind of. bounced a little bit. Oh! I took my leg off. That's kind of weird. Can I keep chopping this up? Alright. So I got some wood chunks here. Small trees? No, we can't do small trees. What about this big giant tree right here? Let's cut this beast down. I don't know if it matters. You know if I go around the tree or not. Oh, there it goes. There it goes. Oh my gosh. Doesn't look, I'm, doesn't look like I'm going to get that tree back. Let's just go inside here. Can I put wood back in there? So once you add the wood, you can't take the wood out. All right, It'll take a while. Maybe I should Cook look around the a bit. food ration. Find fresh water. And optional is to refill canteen. So we will uncooked food ration. Spoiled? I don't think it's spoiled. We'll cook a carrot though. So I want to stand here and wait. Cause I don't want to walk off and this thing get like overcooked, you know, and then it'd be useless. I don't know if it will actually do that or not. Oh, so you just eat it right off the ripper there. It doesn't let me just put it back in my thing. It's like I have to eat it. Oh, no, it's in there. Eat the ration. 
but it never tasted so good. Now, so green. Time to rest. Green things there. All your actions cost energy. When energy energy drops to zero, you will faint. If you faint, you will be exposed to weather conditions as well as lurking wild animals. To restore energy fully, you need to sleep. Think of energy as the amount of time you can spend exploring before going back to sleep. Strategic energy management is the key. So I think the green, I think once the green gets all the way around... I think once the green gets all the way around this thing, that's when it's like actually spoiled. And how do I check my my status here? Hunger, sanity, health, energy. So I'm thirsty and I need to sleep. So I'll just go outside and drink some snow, or eat some snow, and then take a nap. And that should work. Alright, I think I can go out here and do this before. Be You're too exhausted to oh, it won't let me go out. It won't let me go out. So these potatoes take quite some time to... Cook. Alright, so if you right click it, it just goes back over here. See, I don't know if it's spoiled or not. I don't, I don't really want to. Oh well. We'll go to bed. This thing's literally trying to come in my cabin right now. And it's snowing in my cabin. Look at this snow coming in. This thing sounds big and mean. Oh my gosh. Is that a polar bear? Is it white? Is that a polar bear? That was close. Yeah, no kidding. If this bastard approached from the other side, I would be dead by now. Alright, so let's go get water. Shelter wall hole. Don't let me... So it looks like that bear done some damage to my cabin. The bear. It's bleeding. Oh uh, yeah, it is, isn't it? Well that's what it gets. Actually, I should fix this right away. Maybe I can try helping the bear. Fixing the shelter. Activate the instinct mode to find out what's the shelter's status. Interact with it. Fixable objects once you've collected materials that they require. Fixed shelters allow you to sleep safely overnight and maintain a warm temperature. Tip, you'll find ways of sleeping in the wild as a last resort. Remember that being exposed to nature can kill you. I need I need planks of wood, right? So I need to get my axe out. Let's drink some, eat some snow real quick. One more. 
right, let's get some wood here. Take down this big brute here. our cabin keep the heat in. Am I missing it? Alright, so there's that. I guess we just keep chopping. Right now I'm freezing. I'm gonna go inside and warm up real quick. I'm gonna go put a log on the fire. I'm just gonna do one. I'm just gonna do one that way I can get warmed up here before we go back out. So you can't get burned. Cause I'm like right up on this thing. I can't get any closer. Alright. So I'm nice and warm. I wonder if I could do it from the inside. Nope. That's what we got here. Try to patch our cabin up real quick before we go and investigate the bear blood. Why is it... A hole in the wall that was never fixed can be patched up with few planks. Requirements 9. Zero in inventory. Maybe I can use that workbench that was inside. There we go. You can craft items on the crafting tables. Pick the crafting recipe on the right side and click craft. To craft a selected item, upon selecting a, receipt, a recipe, you will see its required items as well as their stock in your inventory. A bear trap, fabric, plank. So I got two planks from one slab of wood, and I think I need nine planks. There we go. Maybe I can make a ba uh, fabric. Quickly put together fabric made from old parachute. Should hold for emergency shelter repairs. Huh. Maybe I can get that, uh... That guy that was hanging his parachute, you guys remember that? Okay, it's not great, but it will keep me safe. But still, I've got to cover the roof somehow. I didn't even do anything. So, I guess I fixed it. that's fixed. The roof though, how do I... I don't even know how to get up there. Alright, so we're going to... So that's 232... 98... Craft the planks. T 10 out of 12. This looks fine. Okay. Oh yeah, investigate the blood stains, get the parachute, fix the shelter roof. Now I close the door here. Don't need no creepy curlies walking in. So investigate the blood stains over here. Who 
Hopefully I didn't slide right into the water. Open inventory and assign a canteen to the quick slot. Press the number assigned to the quick slot to use it. If you use the canteen over the water, it will be refilled. If you use a filled canteen, you'll start drinking. Uh, there we go. Gotta press I. So that's empty. We're gonna go down here and try to get some water. Alright, there we go. So I'm currently a little icy. Let's just run over here and grab this while we're out. I have water. I have food. I have a roof above my head. It's hard. But I can do it. I have to. Alright, so it didn't take any fall damage here, which is nice. We're gonna run, just basically just run down here. Try to grab this guy's stuff. And then bounce. Oh, here's a hot spring. Okay. There we go. Gonna get warmed up. I don't see anything around. Which is alright, I guess. Considering the circumstances. Let the body warm up. Right now we're cold. We were freezing. I think we should be all right. All right, let's go. Let's go. Chicka, 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 chicka. Thought I heard something over there. If there's any wolf. I don't know if there's a pack of wolves or anything, but I have to get this parachute off the tree. Or Ugh. I could just get rid of the whole tree. Oh yeah, you're right. Let's just chop this tree down here. Poor guy. I wonder what's going on. Or if he's got Where is the... Oh, right here. And a carrot. We'll take the carrot. Oh, there's a lot of carrots. Get the carrots. Get the parachute. And we will head back to camp. I do not like this area that I'm in at the moment. I feel like I'm in the trenches. Like Sasquatch is about to show up and do things to me. Can I go through here? Yeah, I can. Let's see what we can craft here. 
Bama. Hi. This should keep the warmth inside. I guess I did it. Uh, let's light a fire real quick. And take a nap. <laughs> Actually, let's try to put these carrots on there. So they can cook. And then eat the potatoes that I cooked. We'll try that. And let's take a nap. We'll just leave the carrots on there and see what happens. Yeah, there we go. Drink some more water here. And get these carrots off the fireplace. that potato on there all right so the potatoes are done we will eat them did not really raise up my levels there all right so I think I'm good to go stay light out I got the water I'm hydrated I'm eight I'm nice and warm and I think it's time to go investigate the, the blood stains for the bear. So stick around for part two. This is part one. Thank you all for watching. Be sure to go hit the like, the follow, the subscribe, drop a comment. If you have any questions, let me know. And part two will be coming out next. Sorry, out. Peace.